Good afternoon. Today I'm going to show you um, a game or simulation called Mission ISS. There it is. As you can see, I'm actually floats, floating above the Earth's atmosphere. And that big spaceship that just actually appeared from me behind me is the International Space Station or ISS. I'm running this simulation on a VR system called the Oculus Quest. It's amazing, isn't it? I didn't realise that the Earth was so big. Okay. Please select training mission or explorer mode right right i've already uh planned this out kind of so what i'm going to do first i'm going to go to the um operate the canada arm and um and i've tried many times to do this without success mission control to iss Please go to node Whoa. 3 for capsule docking. I say again, please go to node 3 for capsule docking. Wrong Use your okay. tablet to see where node 3 is located. When you have the map up, you'll be able to select any module by pointing and touching it with your right index All finger. Right. And you'll immediately node go three. there. Whether you use your hand controls or are selected on the tablet, proceed to node 3. Alright. No, I think I'm going to go there by myself. All I need to do is follow the arrows. Here we are. Go ahead and continue to note three. Whoa. I've been practicing this, you see. Here we are. Oh my god. So node three. Oh, looks like somebody's left some tomato ketchup around. <laughs> oh my and somebody's left uh Puffy. The name of Node 3 is Tranquility. I'm not quite sure where what that is. oxygen generation, uh, carbon dioxide removal, ah. and water recovery is done on the ISS. I see, it's down there. Right. If you haven't found it already, look around for the cupola. Depending on how you're oriented, you can probably find it below you. Without gravity, you can rotate yourself and turn head over heels to make yourself upside down relative to the station. Yes. Press up oh. on your right thumbstick to I rotate thought. until the cupola is over your head. Right. Then move so. yourself up and inside. So I need to invert myself. Uh, there Try it is. looking down. There it is. The cupola is every astronaut's favorite location on the ISS Ooh. because it has such a fantastic view of the Earth. Take a moment to see what home looks like from 250 miles above Ooh, the surface. That must be the Alps. On the, on the top with the... This is also a great spot to watch approaching spacecraft. We have right. an unmanned resupply mission ready to dock at the station. You'll need to commence manual docking. Initiate the docking procedure from your tablet by tapping on your selection with your finger. Okay. Oh, there it is. There's the arm. There's the Canada arm. Okay, so... So, first... What I need to do is... Get the... Oh, here we are. Let's go to... Right, I've tried this um, a few times before. It is very difficult. But, uh, but let's let's have a another go, shall we? <laughs> oh, he's behind me. He's behind me. Approach the controls, and we'll guide you through the procedure. Go on in. Guide me away. Now that you're at the controls, you'll see monitors showing the view from your external cameras. The joysticks in front of you will control the Remote Manipulator System, or RMS, which is the main robotic arm. The RMS is attached to a platform called the Mobile Base System, or MBS. 
translational joystick can move straight in any direction. In and out, left and right, up and down. You should be able to see both the capsule and the capture port okay. on two monitors. Try moving the joysticks and see how the robotic arm so responds. That on the left is the translation, and that on the right is just the joystick. Let's try the joystick. Use the translational joystick on the left and the rotational joystick on the right to bring the arm into position. Ah, I see. Right, I think I believe I need to um, hook up to that spaceship over there and then probably move it to another place. I'm not quite sure where, but. Seems to be getting a little bit close to the station. Let's move it Ooh. about. You should see the docking port highlighted on the capsule above you. Move oh the arm God. to capture position and lock onto the port. Right. Go ahead, ISS. Go ahead, he says. But, um, I'm the only person here, and there's nobody to help me. No experienced astronauts. Okay, let's get under there. Let's see. Or maybe it's that way. Ah. Okay, that's almost right. Yeah, okay, that's the... there's an arrow pointing at where I'm supposed to be docking. Oh, okay, it's under there. It's under there. You're doing pretty well, considering you're also going 17,000 miles an hour upside down. Oh, thanks for just, uh, scaring me on that. Okay. <laughs> That's better. That's much better. Right. And then move it that way. Do not ah. try again and take it slowly this time. <laughs> I need some help. You just left left me here on this space station alone. And I can't even steady myself. Okay, let's try again. We are monitoring your progress, and you have the green light to proceed. Where are you? You, you're on Earth. You should really be up here. Ah, oh, right. Okay. Ah, oh. should be better actually. Uh, oh my god, it's actually it's starting to move by itself now. No, I think, um, I think I need, is it, he's not actually looking at me now. Take your it? time, ISS. Oh, right, okay, sorry, I actually mistakenly grabbed hold of the joystick. Okay, um, let's just, um, forget about this, but, uh, we need to have a, a proper well-trained astronaut to uh, take up, take her over the controls. Okay, let's just go to return from camera operation. Yes, please. Right. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? The first task 
and I failed, but never mind. <laughs> right, oh, okay, now, now I can just like move forwards. No, yeah, that, yeah, forwards. Ah, now, yeah, now I'm away in the station. way there. Right, okay. Right, I just need to move this way. <laughs> now I'm actually, oh, I'm getting very confused. Okay, let's just go this way then. Slightly better. Right. Very confused indeed. Okay. Right now, I believe I can actually uh, go into the space suit. Right. And, and then we'll do a, a quick space walk. Ready myself. Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> that, that, that's done it. That's done it perfectly. Right. Space walk. Why didn't you tell me that that button was there? Okay, let's go for a space walk, shall we? Yeah. This is, should be easier. Easier than that, um, that blasted arm. Okay. Where am I? Oh, it's behind me. Okay. Oh, here we are. Right. Let's just uh, move around the space station here. There's the sun. Don't stare into the sun for too long. Right. Yes. Look at that. It's massive, isn't it? It's a bit quiet out here. It's only because there's no atmosphere. Right. I wonder whether um, my boosters would uh, run out of fuel. Oh, look, that's uh, the, the boot of uh, Italy and Sicily. And that is the... Uh, ISS, oh. this is Mission Control at Johnson. You've gone too far from the station. Ah, I thought you were going to say that. Okay. Don't worry. I still have. Pretty sure I've still got enough fuel to get back to the station. Yeah, let's just have a look around the other side. And that um, spiral arm, I think that's the... I believe that is the uh, that could be the Milky Way galaxy, the spiral arm of it. I'm not quite sure. Let's go straight up. Be careful not to venture too far from the station. Oh my word. No, it looks quite um, small from up here. Right, let's actually go down to here. Yeah, so I, I think, I'm not quite sure, but do you remember the um, Bob and Doug, the astronauts who went up to the, uh, the space station about a month ago? in the, uh, the NASA and uh, Space Edge mission and um, I believe that they actually docked to this uh, port here let's turn around turn around yep 
That could have been the one. Could have well have been the one. So they would have adopted like this. <laughs> Perfectly well. Oh my word, I missed it. Well, ah, that there, lovely sun, that there is where the Russians keep all their vodka. Vodka. Oh. Oh. I believe I've probably had uh, a few vodkas already today. Only joking. Only joking. Right. It's lovely quiet in here, out here. Wow. I wonder what that was. It's just the, um, just the pointer. Okay, grab that and then you can steady yourself like that. Okay, so obviously it will allow you to go around the station, but you can't go very far, obviously. These are solar panels. Now these are much bigger than the solar panels on certain houses. Oh yeah. Oh, Mr. Ooh. Look at that. Let's just move up here. I love it. Right. Right, and I believe I can just like automatically uh, teleport inside the space station. Japan, eh? Oh, right. That's. But I don't think you can actually go into that particular module. I believe they haven't actually mapped out um, completely the ISS. There we are. Right, so let's go inside. Uh, return to spacewalk, yes. Behind me again. Oh, now it's quite noisy in here. So let's move out of, away from the spacewalk area. And let's go over here. The thing is about this, you can actually point at things and then sometimes it will actually give you videos or even pictures. Right, let's have a look at one that has the, actually has uh, videos. Oh, science! Read a let's watch a science video. Astro puffs. Oh, interesting. Let's go this way. Ah, I didn't realise that, that was down there. There's a secret window. Secret window. Right. Oh, there's my spanner. I'd lost that the other day. Ooh, now I've lost it again. Um, any other things I can point at? Like that one. Oh. How about that one. Okay. As we have a scientist on board. Right. What's over here then? Ah.
Well, let's uh, see where there's anything else. Get rid of these pillows. Right. Ah. I wonder what this is. Let's see where there's a video for this. Oh, it's her again. Well, didn't really want to watch all of those videos. Well, hopefully you enjoyed me showing you around the space station. Sorry there's no body here, except for me. <laughs> Whoa! And... Oh no, we don't want to go out outside again. Okay, and these are all the badges. These are all the badges from all the, uh, the space missions. Excellent. Okay, I will see you next time. Bye.